Arby's knows how important it is to keep your busy bees busy. Our new range of cough and immunity syrups. Mga chip, mga bossing, mga friendship, naibig na kayo dyan. Papalitan natin itong through the root access. Papalitan natin, palabasin natin na may nanalo. Possible o na? Possible po. Eh, 20 years na ako tumataya. Wala pa rin ako nanalo at yung mga nanalo, hindi man na pinapakita yung mukha. Pinalubo yung price. Eh di, wow, meron kayong plinanta na tao para tayaan ang lahat ng possible combinations. At ginawa nyo yun, 280 million ang dinastos. Minus dun sa 640, may ganun siya pang 360. Paano gagawin yun? E 414 million combinations. Napakatagal yun. Totoo sa yun. Possible na yun. Especially, itong 640 ay pinalunan pa online. Pwede manipulahin yung machine na para magkaroon na automatic sequence betting na in a matter of minutes or hours, kaya nang matayaan ang lahat ng numero. Pinalubo yung price, yung jackpot, para tayaan. Sino yung tumaya? Ano yung pagtaya? I will explain. IT expert. Ako po niya, ako po niya IT expert para... Sa hearing na ito, ay obvious na naging maamo na sa pagsagot si Attorney Robles sa mga katanungan ni Senator Tulpo, ibang-iba kumpara sa unang hearing, ngayon paman, hindi niya nakaamo si Senator Rafi, at lalo pang nagalit ang Senator ng mapampirma neto ang iba pa nilang kapanpakan sa PCSO, lalo na ang 1.7 billion pesos na kita, ay savings na sana ito, na pwede nang gamitin para sa mga charity projects nila. Subalit ito ay ginastos pa din ng PCSO management, na pwede na sanang magpagamot, ng libong-libong mga pasyente at naipambili na rin sana ng daan-daang ambulansya, wheelchairs, medisina, at iba pang charity ayon sa mandato ng batas. Nakakalungkot na ang 1.7 billion pesos na ito ay napunta lamang sa ilang tao na questionable pa ang mga identity ng mga nasabing nanalo sa jackpot na ito tulad ng hinala ng mga milyon-milyong netizens na ang katanungan ay kung may nanalo nga kaya o may pinapanalo na tropa nila bago pa tumaya at sino-sino pang kasabwat dito. Pakinggan natin ang pangalawang mainit na hearing ng PCSO. Uh, in our agenda, many issues that needs to be tackled. We will tackle a very important and fresh thing issue that has been the main concern for a long time by many local players. And that issue pertains to the integrity of the game. Na ang tanong, talaga bang may nananalo sa loto? Hindi ba naman maninipula yung laro? O baka naman ito ay moro-moro lang, sabi nga ng mga marami na nakipag-usap sa akin. So, isa po yan sa unang-unang natin talakayan. Isahan natin ang concern ng marami, yung pagdadagdag ng 500,000 sa nanalo ng December sa 649. Not only doon sa 649, kundi sa 642, 645, 655, and 658. Kasi nga po, yung pagdadagdag, pagkakarga ng big amount sa isang game, in this case sa 649, in the amount of 500,000 pesos, ay questionable. It is not a smart business practice. Let me remind you that PCSO is in a business of charity. Negotiating po ang PCSO. Walang negosyo sa buong mundo na meron na nga silang kita at yung kita nila ay ibabalik para isugal ng sagayon papanalunin ng isa, ng isang tao. Bakit kinakailangan magdagdag? In the case dun sa 649 ng December game, I think napanalo yun, was it January? At December and January, nagdagdag ng 500 million pesos. Now, let's start with that. Yung po pagdadagdag, pagkakarga, augmentation o tawagin na isang loto game, ang reason noon ay para dumami yung mga mananaya. Matagal na ba na practice yun, Mr. Robles? In uh, October, the board has decided uh, on our 89th anniversary, we uh, increased all bets for 89 million. Uh, that, that is our uh, way of uh, uh, promoting and celebrating our anniversary. Uh, this was taken from the, from the prize fund, Your Honor. 
and on this and the which uh, uh, as our records show really increased our sales the board has decided to create another promo and tawag po namin handog pakabo no? this is really a marketing uh, uh, a marketing campaign to encourage more and as a way of thanking the bettors to bet more and participate more para po pag-usapan yan at uh, again to, ex to excite the market and I'm happy to inform you Mr. Chairman that for the last 30 days bumalik na po yung in-invest namin doon and we made 800 million po in net okay you made 800 million pesos out of that promo and marketing strategy na ginawa ninyo para to encourage the bettors stimulate betting 800 million ang tanong ko po sa inyo unang-una sa lahat legal ho ba yon yung kayo po ay mag-augment sa jackpot ng uh, mga lotto games ninyo coming from the price fund like i said kanina e eh, kita na po yun eh bakit natin ibabalik pa at number two sabi niyo meron kayong surplus eh di wow kung meron kayong surplus gamitin na lang natin dun sa mga very important projects ibalik natin sa charity ibigay natin sa mga uh, ospital paggamot ng mga chemotherapy kidney dialysis so wheelchairs ambulansya bakit natin ibabalik doon sa loto para pustahan at panalunan ng isa o dalawang tao it's not it's a wise business practice do you agree kasi kung sa isang negosyo hindi nila gagawin yun kasi kita mo na yun eh bakit mo ibabalik doon sa jackpot uh, Mr. Chair, ang tawag po namin doon sa price fund reserve, it is really meant, pag nagdi-dip, kunyari, marami hong tinamaan, it was really meant po to be part of the price fund. So as you know po, Mr. Senator, our uh, our revenues are already ano, appropriated by law. So talaga pong may paggagamitin yan. Ay, kung hindi po namin uh, gagamitin yon at the end of the year, it will be reverted back to as dividends. Okay, bago po kayo, nag-decide ng board no 89th anniversary nyo na mag-augment sa jackpot sa lahat ng games lotto games, jackpot kami pang price pot did you do a thorough study para makita kung talagang dapat gawin nyo meaning yung pag-augment pag nyo ng uh, 500,000 halimbawa sa isang game would that generate more revenue para sa PCSO in terms of taxes which nabanggit mo would that 500,000 may babalik yung inimigay nyo may babalik doon sa price fund nag-invest ka kasi ng 500,000 right? so when you invest something dapat in ina-assume mo na pag-aralan mo o na-anticipate mo na na yung 500,000 babalik kasi Lalagay ka ng 500,000 sa 640 na games, i-augment mo. Eh, kung ang babalik lang dyan ay 10% o 15% o 20% o 50% pa, huwag na. Dapat kung nag-invest ka dyan ng 500,000 augmentation doon sa isang jackpot sa 649, dapat ang balik niyan, hindi lang 500,000 or more pa dapat. Ganun dapat ang mga ginawa yung study kasi kung hindi, huwag niya sana ginawa yun. Uh, Mr. Chen, meron po kami pag-aaral dyan, but the rule of thumb po in the lottery, ito po ay jackpot driven. Uh, the more the jackpot is, the more they will come. Yan po ang basic. I understand. Yun. Pero dapat, ang jackpot is progressive in all other countries in the world. Progressive meaning, yung jackpot ay lumalaki base sa mga tumataya base sa dami ng taya. Tama po. I Never agree. in the world, only in the Philippines, na yung jackpot ay dadagdagan hindi dahil sa mga taya, kundi dahil sa kinita na ng PCSO sa price fund reserve. You agree with me? Kasi sa lahat po ng mga... I agree, your honor. I agree your honor. Progressive po yun. I agree, your honor. Uh, it's called the snowballing. Tama po kayo. On a normal, ano po, on a regular basis, that is po what we do. Kaya nga po tinawag namin to, this is a promo po. Once in a while, they go into promotion po talaga. So, ang tanong ko, bago sa pagsunod ko katanungan, 
So yung 500,000 na lang ba na in-invest nyo noong 640, sa 649 games noong December na nanalo may nanalo 640 million, 500 million doon ay galing sa price fund reserve. Nabawi nyo ba yung 500 million na in-invest? Opo, with income pa po. Magkano ang bumalik? Okay, para magpabilis tayo, 6, 640 million yung price. So, ibig sabihin, 140 million lang ang na-generate mula sa mga mananaya. Simple mathematics to. Because the 500 million came from the price fund reserve na inaugment. Mr. Chairman, if I may. Yes. Uh, we added 472,750,000. Well, you, you, you said sa previous hearing, 500 million. Hindi po. Uh, 500, uh, well, it's surrounded off kasi. Yung, yung pot po, binuo as 500, okay, 500. So, magkano po so hindi po yun yung exact dahil dati na pong meron yun. Eh. So, we, we rounded it off para po madali so, naman. So, magkano po yun? Uh, we added 472,750,798. Okay. Ang na-generate pong sales niyan, is 675,122,860 with a, an income of 202 million. Teka mo na, uh, so bago kayo nag-augment ng 470 million doon sa jackpot ng 649, how much was the jackpot price prior to adding 470 million? 28, yung normal po dyan, 28 uh, million po. De Di ba nag-add po kayo ng 472? Opo. Bago niyo po dinagdagan ng 472, magkano po yung jackpot price? Uh, 28 million po, 249,201. So, 28 million? Opo. Okay. So, we added 472 million. And the sales from that uh, from that promo, from, from, from that action po, was... Uh, 675 million 122860 uh, netting us 202,372,061 po. So doon sa dinagdag yung 472, bumalik magkano bumalik po? 675 po. 675 ang balik. Opo. So meron kayong gain na 100 202 po. 202,370. The reason why I'm asking that uh, Mr. Robles Ito yung issue. Sa 649, 14 million ang total combinations. Tama? Opo. You follow me? Okay. So 14 million combinations, you times that sa 20 equals to 280 million. Opo. Tama? So kung mo yung 280 sa 640, kasi yun ang naging jackpot eh. Tama? is equals to 360 million. So, nakapalo ni Papo. Now, lumilitaw, ayon po sa mga tao uh, nag-reply uh, sa akin sa social media, mga tao na kausap ko, yung mga mananaya, pinalubo yung price, yung jackpot, para tayaan at sino yung tumaya? At paano yung pagtaya? I will explain. Meron ba tayong ano rito? Uh, IT expert? Comsec? So, hindi, dapat third party IT expert. Walang kinalaman sa PCSO, walang kinalaman sa Pacific. Day City? Okay, very good. Para magsabi kung totoo ba itong mga sina itong concern kung meron bang basic, basis itong concern na maraming mga mananay sa loto. Okay. You're there and you've been listening. Kanina pa. Good morning, Mr. Chair. Um, uh, good morning to you. And state your name, please, ma'am. I'm um, Attorney Hazel Bianca Ortega from the DICT. Okay. Pwede natin lagi ng pangalan. Si ma'am. Okay. Um, Mr. Chair, uh, first we apologize because right now we don't have any technical experts um, that focuses on online games as of the moment. However, we can um, commit to submit our position paper upon um, gathering all the information that we could discuss in this platform, as, um, most especially in coordination with other um, representatives with other government agencies also. Mr. Chair, thank you. 
Attorney Ortega. Okay, uh, Mr. Robles and uh, Mr. Chua Akua, Chairman of PCSO. So, nandun na po tayo sa 2060 million. Ang sinasabi ng ilan, merong kayong plinanta na tao para tayaan ang lahat ng possible combinations. At ginawa yun yun, 280 million ang ginastos. Minus dun sa 640, may ganun siya pang 360. Paano gagawin yun? E 414 million combinations. Napakatagal yun. Kung tutusin. The ICT is still following. Now, ang sinasabi ngayon nila, possible naman daw yun. Especially, itong 649 ay pinalunan sa online. Pwede manipulahin yung machine na para magkaroon na automatic sequence betting na in a matter of minutes or hours kaya nang matayaan ang lahat ng numero. You follow me, DICT? So is that something, pagsay lang, is that something, is that possible? Um, Mr. Chair, as far as we understand um, the intricacies of the system um, with respect to online gaming and um, specifically for Loto games are very unique and different um, from one another. That's why we really need to um, also um, in, uh, cooperate. Uh, we also really need the cooperation of other government agencies for us to understand how their system works. And... Um, Uh, compare it vice versa with what we know right now in our department, Mr. Chair. Uh, what's your reaction, uh, Mr. Robles? Uh, your concern, Mr. Chair, is very valid. We understand that you really wanted to get at the bottom of this. But uh, uh, kami po ay tumataya. Ang laro po namin, ay, you have to bet it actually. Yung system betting, which is actually with the e -loto, Uh, is actually only for six days yung advance nila. Ano po? So, uh, we don't know of yung sinasabi yung ganyan po karaming massive voting. Uh, hindi ko po alam paano po gagawin yun. And to begin with po, uh, we, we would like to assure you that you can never, never manipulate it. Kaya nga po allowed kami mag-bet, Mr. Chair. Even I can bet. Because it's beyond me, Mr. Chairman. Uh, even if we wanted to, with the system we have, we cannot. Kaya, uh, I take this exception, you know, na kayang panalunin, no? Definitely, marami pong tataya pag nalaki ang, uh, ang jackpot. Yun po naman ang objective namin. So, really bring in the betters, no? Because if mamanipulahin yan, kung kaya pong manipulating yan, your honor, I don't think you had to bet more. Kasi kung ang premise natin ay mamamanipulate, I think just 20 pesos will be enough. Okay. Mr. Chair, uh, Mr. General Manager, uh, you're hearing me, but you're not listening. Wala ko sinasabi na mamanipulahin yung game. There will be no, there's no manipulation actually, kung totoo say. What I'm trying to say here is, tatayaan lahat ng possible combinations. Again, the ICT. Tatayan yung 14 million combinations. Sabi mo kasi may 6 days? Ah, yung advance betting po yan. Okay. Advance betting. Um, Mr. Sir, Chair, sir, if I may. Sir, sir let, let me finish. Tatayan po lahat na itong 14 million combinations. How would that happen? Kasi kung 14 million, hindi naman pwede isang tao taya dito, taya doon, taya doon. Magulo at impossible. Pero pwedeng gawin ng isang tao lang at merong siyang kasabwat sa Pacific online. Mm -hmm. Kasi, di ba yung 649 was one through uh, Iloto? Tama? Okay. Hindi po sa ano po yan sa stand alone po yung uh, okay. over the counter. Sige. Okay, pangalan po dyan. Kahit stand alone. Okay. Ngayon, tatayaan lahat ng possible combination. In matters of days, 
Uh, what not not days in matters of hours may konting adjustment doon sa machine para mag ma, ma, matayaan lahat ng combinations sa PCSO pwedeng magkaroon not in PCSO sa isang bodega diyan sampung machine walang gagawin every second every minute every hour kundi magje-generate ng taya hanggang sa ma-cover na yung 14 million combinations in matters of hour in a matter of hours after 24 hours bingo 10 machines natayaan na yung 14 million combinations that is the reason back why nagkanuntuda yung pagdadagdag kaya nga i'm here to tell you i will stop that practice ninyo na mag-augment from the price fund Mr. Chair, I write this uh, with you. It's a jackpot coming from the price reserve fund. So, you follow me, uh, Mr. Robles? But, Mr. Chair, uh, if I may, uh, betting po on all combinations is a right of anybody. Kung it doesn't guarantee anything po. If, kung assuming somebody betted on the all the combinations which is allowed the mampo if right. you can if you can it doesn't even guarantee you that you will get the the jackpot by yourself no? yes Paring dalawa kayo, tatlo kayo, yes. po. that's number one number two our record shows na hindi naman po binetan po ang lahat ng combinations on the day po ng tinama so you can show us that record opo, opo, na opo. hindi kinayaan hindi po. kasi yun ang concern ng mga opo. betters hindi po, hindi po natayaan Mm -hmm. And you will also show us, hindi lamang sa 649, so sa lahat ng games, opo, opo, 642, opo. 645, 649, 655, and 658, yes, 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 yes. kasi yun ang concern ng opo, opo, opo. So show us the records na hindi lahat ng combinations ay tinayahan. Kasi pag lumitaw na lahat ng combination ay tinayahan para manalo, then doon nagkaroon ng how shall tawagin. Well, sabi ko nga po, well, hindi lang sir, kailangan lang sagutin mo lang, I need a record. Opo, but we'll give you for now. If Sa lahat ng panalo, hindi tinayaan ang lahat ng combinations. Opo. Okay. Now, isa pa dito sa nakausap ko na IT experts. Sample, tataya sa nabaliches ng numero 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Okay. And then, Alam niyo po yung root? Kung tawagin? Root access? I'm sorry, Mr. Chairman. May I refer you to it? Sino bang I expect niya? Root access sa computer. Do, do, yeah, the, uh, do you know what I'm saying? If you're really an expert sa, sa ano, IT, if you're really an IT expert, you should know what is the root access means. Okay. So, naintindihan. Kakaintindihan tayo. At least, meron isa dito na kaintindi. So, tataya ng 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Sabi natin sa babaliches. And then, after matayaan yung 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, pupunta ngayon doon sa main computer system na may root access, yung taong may root access, na pagkatapos ng draw, 9 o'clock, lumabas, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay. Napapalo nyo? Yes, Mr. Chair. So, lumabas yung 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 10 na yan, ha? Nitong si Juan. So, yung merong root access, papalitan niya sa computer, yung 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 na tinayaan. Kahit na ito'y tinayaan sa outlet. Gagawin niyang 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Same serial number, same everything, except yung papalitan niya is the numero. Kasi nga, sa outlet, wala namang resibo. Right? May resibo pa? Pran apply? Wala, di ba? Meron po. Tickets. Okay. Pero sa loto outlet, may resibo. Pero sa e-loto, wala. Meron din po. Electronic. 
Yeah, it's a QRL, but no, okay. no, no. Pero where, where do you keep those uh, receipts? There's so, meron kayong receipts sa lahat ng taya? You mean the, the physical lotto? Yes. Kayo, kayo na sa, sa, ano, sa outlet. Yeah. I so, ano ba, may, may tumaya sa inyo? Yeah, meron kayong to... resibo? Na, sa resibo ng taya? Ibig sabihin yung tumaya? We know. Yung numero yung tinayaan? Actually, we know po the, ano, we, well, it's the computer itself of the of the provider has the number. That's why they know kung nanalo sa outlet. Yeah, no, what I'm trying to say, uh, Ms. Sabir, ng Sorry. National President ng Pulaay, pakisabi mo na anong isa ng Pulaay, ma'am? Philippine Online Lottery Agents Association, Inc. Very good. Ang ibang sabihin, kapag halimbawa ang isang tao tumaya doon sa machine ninyo, sa outlet, di ba? Okay, nabigyan siya ng ticket niya. Meron din ba kayong physical receipt doon sa numero mga tinaya niya with serial number? Wala okay. po. Okay. So, wala. Siyempre, yung receipt na sinasabi niya na meron, yun yung receipt na napupunta yes, sa better. Yes, Chair. Pero yes, Chair. walang naiwang resibo sa inyo para malaman nyo physical evidence na yung tinayaan ng vetor kung ano yon. Yes, Mr. Chair. Okay. Still follow me. Kaya nga, yun sinasabi ko. So, yung may root access na tao, papalitan niya ngayon yung 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. At gagawin niya yung 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay? And then, yung serial number space and all. Pagkatapos niyan, nang magmanipula, magkakaroon na siya ngayon ng ticket na 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 from a machine na nakatago somewhere. Well, of course, you're gonna say no. I'm not asking you, ma'am. Sorry, I'm not asking you. I'm asking the uh, uh, yung IT na merong alam sa root access and then of course the DICT please don't answer if I'm not if I'm not addressing to you please don't answer please at wag po kayong iling iling please just stay calm and composed okay ma'am Sereles yes po uh, Mr. Chair good morning po um, I that is not that cannot be done po now we will be inserting or changing the the bets that is uh, to a winning number doon po. Kasi po, uh, we have established procedure that is ISO certified. And after a, uh, when we draw the balls po, the winning numbers, and then that will be inputted into our system. And that's the time po na magigenerate kung meron pong winner or wala. So, and then that will be validated again to another system that should um, match the result of the production system which is the current um, lottery system uh, online and then we have the backup system where we will produce the, the result of the draw that will match the production and the backup. I understand. I see where you're coming from but what I'm saying is yun ay kayang palitan Kung sino man yung taong may root access, sino-sino po yung mga taong may root access sa inyo? Who are they? Um, Give me the names. The root, uh, the, the, the super... Diba dapat dalawa yan? Merong isang tao, tapos merong isa na nakatago dapat sa safe. Yes po. Okay. Uh, that Now, is... give me the names of the person na merong root access because I need to check his credibility. Uh, but that is the GM po. And GM. I, sorry. So, si GM ang may root access? Uh, our GM po. He has a super user account po and the uh, administrator account and I think Sir Ernan, you have or another as admin and Sir EJM Casas which is Ah, so uh, marami may uh, merong hawak sa root access? We have two po. Two? So is GM sila yung pangalawa? Si Sir Arnel po because he's the assistant general for the gaming Arnel sector. Casas, okay. So si Arnel Casas is, Mr. Casas is the AGM. Okay. So, dalawa. Di ba dapat meron pa isa na sa, sa board yan dapat? O wala na? Dalawa lang? Dalawa. Now, my question to you, DICT, is it possible na yung taong, mga taong may root access can edit? Yung sinasabi nga niya, once na lumabas yung mga games, agad-agad automatic, magsasabing may winner o wala. 
Mr. Chair, sorry, but we shall verify such information with our principals and technical experts. Accordingly, we shall integrate the same in our position paper, Mr. Chair. Okay, so that will be in, in uh, on our next hearing, gusto ko po magpalabas kayo ng inyong opinion. Ito po ay sabi ng mga nakausap kong tao. So ang sinasabi ngayon ay ng uh, nakakaintindi sa root access, it is not being done. It's different that it's not being done, and it, it, it is impossible. Pwede, hindi nyo ginagawa. I'm not saying na ginagawa nyo. So, hindi nyo ginagawa, pero pwede gawin kung gugustuhin. Is that a correct statement for me? Uh, kung gugustuhin, kaya. Pero, hindi nyo ginagawa. With the safeguards po, that is not possible. With the safe, safeguards. And what are those safeguards? Uh, that is po, um, we immediately, uh, like what I have said po kanina, we have the production system, the one yung pong ginagamit natin and the backup. So we immediately match the result of that so that we will establish that there's no insertion or whatever. So, kaya, who, who, who is that person na, 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 who's doing the matching, sabi mo? The matching po, uh, the data security. Data security? Opo. And, and who is that person? Uh, miss, uh, there, it's a team po. A team. Uh, and who's the team leader? Po, uh, with uh, Ralevin. Data security. Oh, data Mind security. you, let me tell you a brief story. There's the biggest scandal in the U.S. na kung saan yung chip security, data security nila, nagmanipula ng lot again at nakulong. But, but so you said not... data security. Oh. Hindi ko pinagbipintaran itong taon to. Pero nabasa mo yun, yung, yung scandal sa U.S., lot of scandal sa U.S.? Uh, si, uh, is that Lipton? Tipton, siya yung data security chief. Minapul Pumasok siya sa computer system. This is a, a, an online game. Minanipula niya. Okay. Sinasabi ko lang yung dinat pangdagdag information. So, the data security yes. there are, um, and representatives also from the internal audit service department. Which is part of PCSO. Yes po. Okay. And then, Walang tagalabas. Meron po, the COA Commission on Audit po, Mr. Chair. Kasama na nanonood? Uh, yes po. They are part of... Na, na, pag, pag yung, pag, pag yung uh, nanalo na yung numero, and then sinisiguro na yung numero nanalo ay, ay uh, tinitingnan, gumagawa na matching, whether on that particular game, somebody won or did not win. Ano na doon yung COA? Yes, uh, part of the audit po, sir. Hindi, hindi kasi binigit mo yung COA. Okay ako sa, <clears throat> gusto ko dapat nandun yung COA kasi kung kayo kayo sa PCSO, eh may pagdududa pa rin sa taong bayan. So dapat may independent. So meron taga COA. And who is that from COA? Nandun ba talaga mismo yung COA physically present? Yes po, Mr. Chair. They are always there po. For they, they are, so you said maraming taga COA. Uh, yes po, they, they are also a group or a team po. They are there as a team? Uh, yes po, there are representatives po for every draw to audit. Same representative process. all the time? Uh, they're uh, on a shifting or rotation schedule. Mga ilan? How many sa ko? Maybe 12 to 15 po. So 12. Alam ko ba't ko tinatanong tulad para masatisfy itong lahat ng katalungan ko galing to hindi to gawa-gawa ko lang. Yes, Ito'y galing sa mga nakakausap ko na nagdududa. Kaya dapat masagot ito ng tama. Dahil kapag hindi nyo nasagot ng tama, yung pagdududa hindi mawawala. So we're here to make sure na maalis yung pagdududa sa isip ng mga tao. O tao. Yes, Mr. Chair. Okay. So, ngayon, meron taga-COA. Sure ka. And I need a record and a CCTV. Dapat siya naka... Hindi pwedeng sa kwarto kayo-kayo lang. Dapat may CCTV recorded and all yung ginagawa. Napapalo ba yan? Yes, from well, Mr. Chair. It How is, is it being done? Opo, uh, it is written in our um, ISO certified process po that um, this procedure should be done and participated by... Well, it should be done. Is it be... Oh, yeah, madaling sabihin should be done. But it is... Is it being done? Yes po, Mr. Chair. And you have proof that it, it, it is being done properly, which is A. Paano? Sa isang room? Uh, yes po, in a room po where the machine or the equipment is there. Okay. And then uh, it is covered, uh, recorded po 
Mm -hmm. And then there's a CCTV din po on that room. Okay. Na para sinasabi na may nanalo or walang nanalo? Uh, yes po. And they attach their signatures on that report. Okay. Pero just the same. Kayo ang nakakaalam nga noon na may nanalo wala. Pero kami sa public, we don't know yet. Until na kayo mag-release ng inyong statements sa PCSO. Now, halimbawa na lang, ito yung wild imaginations from the Petrus. Nagsabwatan lahat. Halimbawa na lang. So, yung may root access, kaya pa rin manipulahin yun. Nag-usap-usap lahat, o, oh, mga chief, mga bossing, mga friendship, naibig na kayo dyan. Papalitan natin itong through the root access. May root access. Palitan natin, palapasin natin na may nanalo. Hindi nyo ginawa yun. Wala akong binibinta. Possible or not? Possible po. Thank you. I rest my case. Mr. Chair, uh, if I may, I understand po yung sinasabi nyo, yung meron ng nanalo, tapos hahabulin nila ng panalo. Is, uh, ganun po ba ang ano, from my system? Uh, I'd just like to inform the committee that we had the say, ako po, when I came, yun din po ang una kong tinignan. But ang, ang practice po is uh, at 8.30, cut off na po. All bets are separated in a flash drive. Stand alone po yun, it's not online. So hiwalay na po yun. So for that alone, hindi na po pwede ma-insert yun. May stand alone po na computer. In fact, pag nanonood po ang mga tao sa amin, almost real, real time po ang pagpasok ng bola dun sa stand alone na yun. So, I don't think it's possible kasi hindi na po online yun eh. Nasa drive na yun eh. Kaya kami po sa group namin, nauuna po kami malaman because almost simultaneous po paglabas ng number, pindot siya. Almost simultaneous po. So, huwag po kayo magalala. There's no way mapepenetrate nila dahil nakihawalay na po yung lahat ng bets na pumasok. Hindi na po pwedeng dagdagan yun. At our cut-off, kaya po 8.30 kami, cut-off na po yun. At 9 o'clock, drawn na po. But there's a 30 minute yan na hindi na po pwedeng pasukan ng bets. Kahit po gustuhin, even online, hindi na po nila may papasok. So, dahil, dahil, ano po, Mr. Roberts, dahil? Kasi po, na kaya stand alone na po yun, kung bagay na-separate na po. And the computer? Ah, uh, yung uh, flash drive po, flash drive. na po lahat ng bets. I remind you, Mr. Robles, I'm not an IT expert. Okay, hindi ako nagmamagalingan. Pero lahat ng computer kaya ikurap. Well, in fact, the best computer, the most secured computer, even sa Pentagon na computer, supposed to be the most safest and guarded computer on this planet, ay nakurap o na-penetrate ng isang hacker. So don't tell me, yung computer ninyo na sinasabi mo drive, hindi kayo makurap. Now, I'm, I'm just saying, Your Honor, that this that's the process that we have. Kaya, hindi, para, para Kaya na, Mr. Robles, yes, I'm not saying na nandaraya kayo, pero it's possible, tulad nga sinabi ng, ni, uh, anong pangalan ni po, Madam? Ma'am May. So, lahat ng computer, as long as it's a computer, kaya makurap yan, kaya maiha. Yun yung uh, akin pinupoint out dito. So, therefore, with this, ang gusto ko pong ma mangyari, where's the BIR here? Hello, Mr. Chair. BIR, pagbabanggay natin lahat ng mga nanalo sa loto. Let's start with, kasi alam ko it will take some time. Yes. Um, September. September of 2023. All winnings ng September 23, ibabangga natin sa BIR na magagaling sa PCSO. Kunyari, ang winner ay para mapabilis tayo, ang winner ay sa lahat ng games is 20. Kunyari na lang, 20 winners sa September equals to sabi natin 100 million. So yung 100 million, 20% tax is 20 million. So dapat magmamatch yan. Lalabas sa BIR, dapat 20 katao ang tumaya at 20 million ang pinayarang tax. I need that kind of record from the BIR sa so next hearing. Can you do that? So, magbabanggaan 
Uh, yes, Mr. Chair. Um, ano lang po, um, kasi unfortunately, Mr. Chair, um, under Section 270 ng Tax Code, uh, we are prohibited from disclosing exact information on the returns filed unless siguro po may consent from the taxpayer. So if mabigyan po kami ng PCSO ng written consent na they are um, allowing Hindi us to disclose dapat, po. Dapat, dapat i-deliver sa PINA. Hindi pwede tawag mo yung record na yan. It will be subpoena. Kung yes, kinakalang pupunta sa korte, I will do that. Apo. Very important yes. yan. Kasi, yes. magkala, kasi pag nasagot nito lahat, tatahimik na ako. Kasi itong sinasabi ko, you agree, para maalis po yung agam-agam ng taong bayan. Kasi for the longest time, marami na dududa eh. Meron pa ano, nag-chat sa akin, nag-text sa akin, Idol, sir, eh, 20 years na ako tumataya. Wala pa ako nanalo. At yung mga nanalo, hindi man na pinapakita yung mukha. Ito pa, lately, nag, ang daming pera ng PCSO, poor editing pa. Sana naman lang, kumuha kayo ng magaling na editor. Yung kinuha niyo editor, parang kindergarten. O di, nagkaduda po, di ba? So, Mr. Tibay, Attorney Tibayan, sir, so how can we obtain that record?